Hey everyone, welcome back to Installation 00. Today we're featuring an interview I had with Krillcast. We actually recorded an entire week's worth of content and that's been being uploaded this week so far. So you've actually missed some content with Installation 00 featuring in it. So pop over to Krillcast, subscribe to them. You'll be able to catch up on the videos you've missed and see the videos that are still to be released this week. Plus you'll also get to see a load of their content where they've had other interviews with other Halo YouTubers and talk about, well, practically everything. But for now, I'll leave you with the first eight minutes of nearly an hour's worth of an interview. Hope you guys enjoy it. This is the Krillcast. I'm Chris. And I'm Billy Natwill. <laughs> and we have a guest today. Uh, hi, I'm Installation Zero Zero, or Mister Zero Zero, as some people have affectionately called me. And uh, I'm actually not stalking him by looking up pictures of him. I was trying to find a good picture for the podcast. I forgot to change screens, so you'll have to forgive me for that. <laughs> That's a nice way of That's saying no I'm problem. stalking him. Yeah. It's okay. Today is the uh, normal. Weirder things have happened. <laughs> <laughs> Today is the normal uh, Wildcard Wednesday segment, but we're not doing a normal bit. Uh, in fact. We're going to be doing an interview with Installation Zero Zero or Mr. Zero, uh, Mr. Zero Zero, um, Zero Zero, whichever, which, whichever way you want to Let's call him. Roll, roll with whatever you want to roll with. This is absolutely fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I'm going to pull up his channel uh, and we're going to talk about his channel and what he's been doing on YouTube for however many years he's been doing it. Um, so well, why don't we just... in, the, in, in the years yet, to be fair. Okay. <laughs> Getting there. There you go. My bad. <laughs> uh, you have to forgive me. It's been a long day. Um, let Billy guess the first question. Billy, you got the script up? Yep, absolutely. Um, so, Mr. Zero Zero, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what inspired you to make uh, make your channel all about the Halo series? Um, well, I've I've been a fan of Halo since like the absolute beginning, like 2001 Halo CE. Um, and it, it just defined my childhood. It was, it was, there were games that I played and, and just got completely and utterly immersed. And I got the books, I got the comic books, uh, you know, figurines. I, the, I literally went full hog. I got the limited edition um, Xbox 360 console. It was, I was fully immersed in, in Halo. Um, I went through college, did electronic and computer engineering. Um, and then I went into university and did um, computer science and material science. And from that, I kind of started putting two and two together. So um, my interest in Halo sort of intersected with my sort of professional qualifications. Um, and I started sort of making sort of passive notes about, oh, maybe, you know, maybe Mjolnir armor could be made of this kind of metal or that kind of metal, or maybe the systems that run it do this or do that. Um, and eventually it got to a point where I had basically what was the beginnings of a script sat in front of me. And I thought, well, sod it, I might as well record this and, and turn it into a video. Just if nothing else, just to collate everything and have it as a, a, an easy digestible format. Um, and then I thought, well, I might as well upload it. So I uploaded the first um, most detailed series, uh, most detailed episode, which was the Mark VI, and uh, suddenly started getting views and then comments and then subscribers. And then suddenly, before I knew it, I was getting demands for doing other most detailed breakdowns, and it just kind of snowballed from there. And here we are. Yeah, you definitely, uh, you definitely take it all the way down to like as low of details as you can get it seems like you spent a lot of time delving into the smaller details as covenant canon was telling us last night um when we talked to him i think it's really cool when somebody has that amount of interest in something to break it down as far as you have well absolutely i mean it, it's it's like i said it's just the, the professional qualifications and the, and the two intersecting i suppose just yeah it was a, a match made in heaven for those of us who are absolutely and utterly obsessed with extraneous detail <laughs> you're just to tell you man you're pat like i've, I've watched a couple of, um, i've watched you before too but i've watched a lot in the last like day or so but your passion is like amazing for this by the way like, i, I just want to say that like it was really cool to watch your stuff yeah I, well like i say it's it, it defined my childhood and and so, some of my some of my happiest memories were, were doing land parties with mates and and you know with junk food and 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 soda and beer and whatever else and just ha just having a laugh sat around the really old crt televisions they're really heavy we'd even <laughs> lug them to each other's houses that's how that's how much we were dedicated to the course so um 
yeah, it, it just defined my childhood. I'm, I, it, it's a passion, and, and I'm I'm pleased to be in a position where I'm, you know, sort of reaching out to a lot of people. Yeah, I have to say, um, I, I didn't realize your channel was only like July seventh, twenty eighteen. Is that true? Yep, yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's that's when um that's when the first the first video went up. Um, and it's it's sort of with most YouTube channels, it started really slowly to start with. Um, I must have uploaded a, a good couple of dozen videos by the time that um Eckhart's Ladder. Uh, found me he'd been apparently watching some of my stuff um and we did a collaboration um and he wanted to do like a kind of a an assess an, an analysis of one of the um one of the unsc ships and i thought okay well i've I've got to do you know something big to really make a, an impression on you know Eckhart, <laughs> but also the the halo community at large so i thought okay sod it he's, he's going to give me like an eight minute video on a on a unsc ship i'm going to give him a 38 minute video on the most detailed breakdown of the pillar of autumn um <laughs> and i was fully expect i was fully prepared for him to like just go like i can't come on man i can't upload this to my channel this is ridiculous but he did it <laughs> and i went from 767 subscribers to 16,000 um overnight which wow. was just incredible so absolute props to to eckhart Sada for giving me the, the the break as as early on as he did that's um, awesome so yeah, yeah awesome yeah i think that's kind of the goal i've had in the background of this podcast is if we ever got enough subscribers to make a dent at youtube we would definitely be shouting out the small youtubers that we enjoy watching and bringing them on the show for stuff like this obviously your channel dwarf stars so there's not going to be a whole lot gained from this for you obviously because your channel is so much bigger than ours but it's still really neat to talk to people like you, and that's why I like doing this. So it's, it's part of the ethos, isn't it, of the Halo community? I mean, Eck, Eckhart was nice enough to give me that that leg up into the into the Halo YouTubers community, and and since that's happened, I've collaborated with other Halo YouTubers. I've I've collaborated with smaller channels to try to sort of pick them up. I've I've even found you know sort of with with some of my more recent um, videos. So like the um, I'm doing a um, some analysis of uh, dr Catherine holsey's diary so i found a voice actor who uh, she's called cat peterson she's on she's on twitter and and her her dr holsey impression is absolutely phenomenal i mean it's it's literally like bang on um <laughs> and being able to bring that to light and and to see the response of the community to somebody who's got a voice that is so so similar to to, to dr holsey is is great and um yeah it's just, it's just it's just nice sort of giving back in the same way that someone gave me the leg up.